that back up here on the mill. I don't have the proper part because I couldn't get it overnight, obviously. But also because I went on Timber King's website and it threw like an alert, like the site had been hacked or something. I'm not really sure. But it wouldn't actually go to their site for some reason. It said it said it was an imposter site or something trying to steal my information. So I don't know what's going on with that. Oh well. So what I got for today is just a standard bolt. It's not even grade eight. They didn't have any grade eights at the hardware store I went to, which is a little frustrating. How's a man supposed to work on equipment without grade eight bolts? But I'm just gonna try to throw this up in there and hope that it's at least enough to let me resume work for now, which is gonna be hard with all these little dinky washers that wanna fall out. These washers don't appear to have a particular way that they sit in there either. I don't know. I might have got something a little jerry rigged here. I might have somebody's somebody else's bush fix that I'm trying to bush fix. But what I'm gonna try to do anyway is. use this bolt for now as a way to get it rolling which of course now that I'm trying to put it in there it's jamming up the bolt fit and store just fine see there's that stinking washer in the middle of it that's still part of the broke broken bearing and it is not wanting to cooperate with me get it to fit through there and stay, I think it'll roll. than I was expecting. <laughs> the other funny thing about this brake is how it's... Um, it's like it's making the wheel want to roll at a angle. It seems there's some additional play in here. I don't think really seems like a factory design, but what do I know? That's why I said I think I might be trying to fix somebody else's fix. I mean, oh, dog on you. Going back now, I got her on there. It's spinning. 
The wheel is spinning. For now, and I know this is gonna wear out. This is not the long-term fix. And I couldn't find a Teflon nut. So we're gonna do the old double nut trick here. Tighten one against the other. <clears throat> That actually lets the wheel is spinning and the bolt can spin if it wants to. That's that. Just sit down here and see how it rolls. Feels like it's rolling a little better than it was. Again, this is not the permanent fix. Oh, but also last night when I picked it up, I messed up my feed cable, so now I gotta fix that. I always forget. So it's on there for what it's worth. Let me get my cable over here fixed and then I'll see how it rolls. <laughs> 